scientists say a fairly large explosion in Hawaii's erupting Kilauea volcano is likely to be the first of a series of larger explosions that could begin to throw rocks and ash from the crater. A small earthquake may have caused rock falls into the crater and prompted the explosion from the lava lake surface that shot projectiles out of the rim. Reuters' Havorvi Cooper reports. There's a lot of outbreak I'm hearing. A grave warning for residents of Hawaii's Big place. Island. Um, the eruption of Kilauea volcano could intensify in the coming weeks, possibly spraying pebble-sized projectiles for miles. The U.S. Geological Survey said Wednesday that more violent eruptions could shoot ballistic blocks weighing up to several tons and cover dozens of miles with ash. So what could trigger these new eruptions? Geologists say that if the lava lake in Kilauea's crater continues to sink, the influx of water mixed with lava could create new steam-driven explosions. At risk, the nearby town of Hilo, with a population of 43,000, and the village of Bahoa, about 24 miles east of the volcano. We're at the end of Nohea Street. Ooh, I just got a whiff. Fourteen fissures have opened up on the big island since Kilauea first erupted on Thursday, spraying fountains of lava up to 300 feet into the air. Some of those vents are still emitting sulfur dioxide gas. That could combine with moisture in the air to cause acid rain, posing respiratory problems. Massive piles of smoldering lava like this one now cover approximately 104 acres of land on the big island. And that is Reuters' Havorvi Cooper reporting there for us on Checkpoint.